Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how we can pair Shelly One with Shelly Cloud app. And we are starting this video just from the point where we left last video. In the last video, we did the wiring for Shelly One app, and uh, it is very important that the Shelly One or any Shelly switch. Uh, is wired correctly so that is what I showed you in the last video and in this video we are starting from the same point uh, where we left the last video and we will be pairing the Shelly switch with the Shelly cloud app so that we can use it remotely so let's get started so first thing first we need to install the Shelly cloud app we need to go to play store and uh, here I already have it you need to go to and search search Shelly cloud and Okay, so in the first top you can see that I'm getting the Shelly Cloud. I've already installed this app to save some time. Okay, uh, but rest of the ste steps I will be doing in this video. So after installing this app, just open this app, and first you need to create an account. So I will go ahead and create an account. Okay, I need to agree to the terms and conditions. Email address, password twice. And account is created. And now I need to log in. So it's giving me a welcome screen and some informations regarding the app. I mean, how to use it. And now we are on the first screen which says add room. So I will add a room. Okay, I will name it bedroom because the picture looks like a bedroom and save it okay so it says room saved successfully okay next we need to add a device currently you don't have any devices in this room to add a device click on the button below so here we will display all Shelly devices that are currently in the same network to include device click the button below so before uh, going forward with this step I think I need to turn on my uh, Shelly switch and I will give it few seconds to boot up and then I will continue with the search for new device process okay 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 it's asking to select the router that I have I will select my router it, it's asking for the password of the router I will enter the password Okay, so I selected the router that I have and I entered the password and now it's uh, adding the device and verifying it. So let's see what happens next.
so verification process might take little time Okay, so it says could not include the detected device in your Wi-Fi network. One nearby. Uh, okay, so uh, this can happen. Okay, because sometimes there is a, a network issue. Okay but uh, during this process i will also show you uh, that suppose it's not get added the process is not complete at one go then what to do then simply we need to reset the uh, device because it has stopped in the midway process you can see we cannot find any shelly in the device list so uh, we have to reset the device to reset the device just turn it off and wait for a few seconds and turn it back on and wait for few seconds again for five to seven seconds and you need to toggle the switch that is connected to sw five times and you will hear a sound like this and the device will be resetted and then you will be able to see a shelly something like this okay so now again we can uh, go for the uh, process of adding the device okay mm. okay let's continue with the process Add device, search new device, okay, okay, so let's try once again. Okay, so I think this time it was successful. Now it's verifying the included devices. Okay, inclusion was completed. One device was included in your Wi Fi network. Okay, so now let's go back and search for the device. Okay, discover devices. Here I have the device. Okay, so it is working. Okay, so I'm turning it on from here and I'm turning it off from here. So it's working like a two way switch. So we successfully paired the Shelly switch. Okay, so the thing that I would like to highlight here is that uh, sometimes it due to network issues uh, you might have to try uh, one to two times or even three times okay uh, but it will definitely work if like your device if your Shelly uh, SSID is showing in the 
Wi-Fi list of your mobile then def uh, device is working correctly and it will definitely work okay so uh, I hope guys you found this video informative uh, and uh, in uh, again we will uh, uh, do some videos on Shelly or any other home automation so please do subscribe to the channel and please do uh, like the video please do give it a thumbs up and make sure to check our website iswitch.online where we provide you home automation products at a reasonable price okay and uh, i will put the uh, the link of the website in our description so please do check it thank you so much for watching this video have a nice day